Let me teach you a mystery. You don't first know how a vision will be accomplished before you have it. That's the problem. The vision must be born. It is the vision that generates how it will happen. You understand? You cook, sir. You cook. Can you cook jollof rice? By the grace of God. They don't cook by the grace of God. Though. <laughs> but you know jollof rice. What do you need to cook jollof rice? Rice, of course. Tomato, yes, sir. Onions, yes. Pepper, yes. Ma of course, Maggi. You have tried. You have tried. Are you married? Now, if, what's the name, sir? Pastor Pascal, sir. If you're married and you have decided to cook jollof rice for your wife on um, today's um, Thursday, on Monday morning, as a surprise, all those things you are thinking about is what you'll be looking for. Vision determines what you search for. Will you look for yam? Because it's not in the vision. Now, he mentioned onions. If there are no onions in the house, and there is a woman that sells onions on Pastor Pascal Street that he has never greeted, not because of Malizo, but because he needs onions, what happens? The greeting will start. Vision determines your relationships. It's the vision first. Visions of greatness will help you attract ingredients of greatness. Where you are today is a function of the way you have been thinking. 